Tonight from Glasscock County as residents find out just how much damage that devastating tornado caused. Right now, insurance agents working to assess what's left of Magnolia Baptist Church. It is a tough week for the pastor, the tornado, but also his house burned down this week. Our Rachel Moore found him keeping the faith and planning to rebuild. So the wife's in the hospital and the house is burnt down and the church is blown away. Quite a week. <laughs> Pastor Michael Stewart says even he can't believe he's still in good spirits after what he calls one of the most difficult weeks of his life. Pastor of Magnolia Baptist Church in Glasgow County, seeing the destruction caused by an EF1 tornado Tuesday night would seem hard enough to bear. But that's not the worst thing that's happened to him this week. Right, right where that metal thing is. Right there. On Monday, like Pastor Stewart's home burned to ash. His wife Hilda got too close to a space heater, and her flannel gown caught fire. She suffered second-degree burns. After bundling up the gown, she left it on the dresser, and the two rushed to the hospital. A neighbor of mine called and said, your house is on fire. Uh, it's about half burned. I don't think it's going to, they're going to be able to save it. Family photos and heirlooms melted away. Furniture burnt to pieces. I might be standing on the first step of the house that's totally gone, um, but he has just elevated us to a, a level that there's joy in the midst of a tough time. Back at the church, insurance agents are assessing the damage. They don't have an estimate yet, but they say it will be thousands of dollars worth of repairs. Pastor Stewart says they might rebuild the church on the land behind the building and expand their cemetery. But for now, he says he'll keep the faith and trust there's a purpose for the destruction. In Glasgow County, Rachel Moore, WFXG, Fox 54. Now, 